Well, the diagnosis of breast cancer can literally turn your life upside down, but there is hope. And that's what our own Andrea Moorhead shared this morning during a health summit where women like her, who are fighting a very aggressive form of cancer, got some good news. <laughs> The third annual Stay Alert, Stay Alive Breast Health Summit brought together health professionals, caregivers, and survivors to discuss solutions to reduce breast cancer disparities. It's kind of emotional because I have a daughter and I just want to make sure that she understands that she needs to know her body and, you know, make sure that um, she just takes care of herself and just be empowered. Black women in Indianapolis are 41% more likely to die from breast cancer than white women. But the Red Alliance and Pink Forever groups are working to reduce that statistic, providing education and access to mammograms. Through our partner, St. Vincent, we have the mobile mammography band here. We provided mammograms, but we also have all these organizations here at our Health and Wellness Expo that can also connect people. The summit connected people with a number of wellness resources, including God's Pharmacy, with free healthy food. In fact, we had a participant come by and said she doesn't particularly eat fruits or vegetables, but this makes her want to eat fruit, fruits, vegetables, and we have a bounty of it. The triple negative breast cancer at this time point. Than the and there were plenty of questions about why African American women get triple negative breast cancer more than others. We suspect it's somewhat genetically ingrained, so our ancestry probably dictates the breast that is more likely to form this sort of tumor. And it's a problem because it's a type of tumor that doesn't have good targeted therapy. But just yesterday, the FDA approved a new type of therapy called immunotherapy that could reduce the reoccurrence of cancer for African American survivors. A revolutionary treatment that allows a patient's own immune system to attack the cancer. This is an amazing discovery for triple negative breast cancer, one that we think will have major impact on survival. <laughs> The resounding message from the Red Alliance, it takes everyone to be all in to help eliminate breast cancer. I mean, they took me under their wings and they showed me different resources and how to be an advocate for myself and others. And that's our Andrea Moorhead reporting. Now to learn more about the Red Alliance, you can go to WTHR.com and just click on this story.